Yep, there he is. Dead in the water. Now all I have to do is get him out of there. Call it 46 centimetres nose to tail. Sorry, nose to backside. And then another hmm, 28 centimetres of scaly tail. So he is 74 centimetres overall length. You can probably see just behind the left eye there is where the bullet went in. Made quite a mess on the way out. Turn him over. Yes, came out just in front of... Just in front of the right ear. So, as you'd expect from where I was shooting, it's travelling slightly downwards, transited the brain, instant kill. Never felt a thing. So let's we'll stick him in and see what he weighs. Heavy enough. That is five and one quarter kilos, which is about eleven and a half pounds according to this. Let's see if I can get a close up of this. There you go. Quite a big guy. Feels heavy enough now he's in the bag. Now this is what our other koi pew was concentrating on. Which looks to me like a dead koi pew lying in the water, trying to get out through the chain link fence here into the stream behind, which is what feeds our lake. That's the stream running off to the right there. And this is the start of the lake. All the way down to the house end there. Okay, so here we are back on dry land. As you can see, the, uh, the koi pea that drowned was a bit of a monster. Let's see if I can zoom in on the, uh, the actual dimensions. It is 60 centimetres from nose to backside. And pretty much exactly a metre nose to tail. Makes the other one look pretty small. I'm going to weigh it. I don't know how much sense that will make because uh, it's obviously bloated a little from being in the, the pond for a couple of days, I would think. I think I need a bigger bag. Alright, so those two bags together will weigh one kilo. Jeez. About 
23 and a half pounds, just over 11 kilos. And I can tell you that's fairly heavy. One other thing I was going to show you is the teeth on this monster. Top to bottom they are five centimeters and they are ugly. And yes, in case you're wondering, it's starting to smell. So uh, I think I'll go bag him up now. Thanks for watching.